Hello, Min. Good evening. <laughs> okay, so can you hear me well? Yeah. Please speak. I, I, I don't, I don't listen to the girl. I, yeah. I don't listen. I don't listen well. Ah, yeah. How about this one, Min? Can you hear me well? Yeah. Okay, I can see great. well. Ah, uh, yeah. Okay, sorry about that because my internet's not good. Anyway, I'll just send this one to you in Zalo again. Yeah, because for today, we will just have a practice test for your listening skill. Okay, anyway, how are you today? How are you today, Min? I can see you well. You cannot see me well? Yeah. Yeah? Ah, that's fine. That's fine. <laughs> that's fine. As long as you can, I'm go. I'm gonna send you the picture, and you will hear teacher A M very well. That's the most important thing tonight. Okay. So here it is, Min. Did you see the the picture that I sent to you in Zalo? Did you see me in? Then. Okay. Did you see the picture that I sent to you in Zalo? Yes. So can you see it clearly in Zalo? Yes or no? Yes? Okay, so now mean we will have a practice test for your listening skill. So all you need to do is to listen and draw a line. There is one example here. So I want you to listen and look at the picture that I sent to you in Zalo so that you can draw lines. Are you now ready? Are you now ready? Okay, so please listen carefully. Here it is. Part 1. Look at part 1. Look at the picture. Listen and look. There is one example. Hello, is Mary here? Yes, she's listening to a CD. Is she wearing a red skirt? Yes, that's Mary. She loves music. Can you see the line? This is an example. Now you listen and draw lines. One. Where's Tom? He's drawing a picture on the board. There are two boys drawing. Which one is Tom? He's drawing a car. Oh, yes. I can see him now. Two. Where's Jane? She's playing with a toy. Is she playing with a toy plane? No. She's playing with a bus. Oh, yes. I can see her. Three. I'm looking for Paul. Can you see him? What's he wearing today? Black trousers, I think. Oh, yes. He's standing at the board. I see. He's drawing a house. 
Four. Look at Anna. Where is she? She's standing by the door. Is she wearing a red T-shirt? Yes, she is. And she's got a toy plane. Five. Can you see Pat? Yes, I can. She's working. What's she doing? She's working at the computer. Oh, yes. She likes that. Now listen to part one again. One. Where's Tom? He's drawing a picture on the board. There are two boys drawing. Which one is Tom? He's drawing a car. Oh, yes. I can see him now. Two. Where's Jane? She's playing with a toy. Is she playing with a toy plane? No. She's playing with a bus. Oh, yes. I can see her. Three. I'm looking for Paul. Can you see him? What's he wearing today? Black trousers, I think. Oh, yes. He's standing at the board. I see. He's drawing a house. Four. Look at Anna. Where is she? She's standing by the door. Is she wearing a red T-shirt? Yes, she is. And she's got a toy plane. Five. Can you see Pat? Yes, I can. She's working. What's she doing? She's working at the computer. Oh, yes. She likes that. <laughs> that is the end of part one. OK. So now, Min, did you hear effectively? Yes? Or do you want to listen again? What do you yeah. want? Listen, yeah. listen again? Yeah. Okay. So let's listen and please check or double check your answers. There you go. Part one. Look at part one. Look at the picture. Listen and look. There is one example. Hello. Is Mary here? Yes. She's listening to a CD. Is she wearing a red skirt? Yes. That's Mary. She loves music. Can you see the line? This is an example. Now you listen and draw lines. One. Where's Tom? He's drawing a picture on the board. There are two boys drawing. Which one is Tom? He's drawing a car. Oh, yes. I can see him now. Two. Where's Jane? She's playing with a toy. Is she playing with a toy plane? No. She's playing with a bus. Oh, yes. I can see her. Three. I'm looking for Paul. Can you see him? What's he wearing today? Black trousers, I think. Oh, yes. He's standing at the board. I see. He's drawing a house. Four. Look at Anna. Where is she? She's standing by the door. Is she wearing a red T-shirt? Yes, she is. And she's got a toy plane. Five. Can you see Pat? Yes, I can. She's working. What's she doing? She's working at the computer. Oh, yes. She likes that. Now listen to part one again. One. 
Where's Tom? He's drawing a picture on the board. There are two boys drawing. Which one is Tom? He's drawing a car. Oh, yes. Yep. I can see no. him now. No. 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 Two. Okay. Where's Jane? She's playing with a toy. Is she playing no. with a toy? Okay, so you are now ready to check your answer? Yeah. Okay, so here it is. Can you please read number one? I want you to read. Tom and the boy. Tom and the boy drawing a car on the board. Okay, so that is Tom and the boy drawing the car on the board. Very good. How about number two, Min? Can you please read? Zen and the girl playing with a toy bus. Okay, this is Jane. Very good. How about number three? Polo and the boy drawing a house on the board. Okay, you say oh. Paul. Paul. Oh. Okay, Paul and the boy drawing a house on the board. Yes, that is Paul. How about number four? Anna and the girl holding a toy plane. Okay, where is Anna? There is Anna. Great job. What about the last number, Min? Ka and the girl sitting on front of the cucumber. Okay, computer. So this is Pat. Wow, great job, Min. Because you got a perfect score, which is five out of five. Yay! Okay, yes. so now, Min. Let's proceed with part two. Can you see this one clearly? Can you see clearly now? Okay. Yeah. Okay, so this time I want you to listen carefully and you write a name or a number. There is one example. Are you now ready? Yeah. Okay, so please listen carefully. Part two. Part two. Listen and look. There is one example. Hello, Mary. Can I ask you some questions? All right. What's your family name? Do you mean Mary? No, your second name. Oh, that's Smith. Is that S M I T H? Yes. Can you see the answer? Now you listen and write. One. And how old are you, Mary? I'm nine. It was my birthday last week. Did you have a party? Yes, it was good. Two. Now... What about your hair? My hair? Yes. What colour is it? It's blonde. Three. And what about your eyes? Do you need to know the colour of my eyes? Yes, please. They're blue. You've got very beautiful eyes, Mary. <laughs> Thank you. Thì con đọc từ nào đây rồi bố? Cô muốn phát âm của cô viết họ con đọc thôi. Cô tí con đọc, cô không biết viết. Con đọc thôi. Now some questions about your family. Is that okay? Yes, it's okay. Have you got any brothers? Yes, I've got three brothers. Two are older than me and one is younger. That's a big family. I like big families. Five. What about sisters? How many sisters have you got? Four. There are a lot of people in our house. Now listen to part two again. Oh, oh. One. And how old are you, Mary? 
I'm nine. It was my birthday last week. Did you have a party? Yes, it was good. From Malcolm. Yeah. Now, what about your hair? My hair? Yes. Do you still want to listen again? No. No. Okay. So. I don't. I don't know to write. What do you mean you don't know to write? You don't know how to spell? Yeah. Ah, that's fine. That's fine. But you know the answer. If you know the answer, just tell the teacher. Okay? You don't need to write if you don't know how to spell. Just tell me the answer directly. Okay, so the name of the girl is Mary Smith. How old is Mary Smith? How old? That's nine. nine. You say she is nine years old. Nine. You say she is nine years old. She is nine years old. Very good. What's her hair color? What's the color of her hair? It, it's yellow. Very good. That is blonde. But yeah, bland is quite yellow, so I'll consider that one as correct answer. Okay, what's the color of her eyes? It, it's bright. Okay, it's blue. How many brothers does Mary Smith have? It's three and four. Okay, you say she have three brothers. You repeat, she have three brothers. You repeat after me, Min. She have three, have three, three brothers. brothers. Very good. How many sisters does she have? It's four. Okay, My very good. You say four. There are four sisters. Great job, Mean. That's correct. So for this one, you got three out of five. So do you have any question to me? Ah, uh, no, 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 not three. You got almost perfect score, which is four out of five. Yeah, that's that's okay. So now, Mean, oh, let's proceed with part three so i want you to answer the question what did paul do last week i want you to listen and draw a line from the day to the correct picture so there is one example here are you now ready mean yeah okay so please listen carefully and you are allowed to listen twice okay here it is part three Look at the pictures. What did Paul do last week? Listen and look. There is one example. Hello, Paul. Did you have a good week? Yes, Grandma. I played a lot of sport. What did you do on Tuesday? On Tuesday, I played hockey at school. Great! Can you see the line from the word Tuesday? On Tuesday, Paul played hockey at school. Now you listen and draw lines. One. What did you do on Thursday? It rained that day. I watched basketball on Thursday. At school? No, I didn't go to school that day. I watched it on TV with Dad. It was an exciting game. Two. I sometimes go swimming on Friday, but not last week. It was my friend's birthday. Oh, what did you do? We went to the cinema to see a film about someone who lived on an island. Hmm.
three. And what did you do on Wednesday? I went to the pool. I was there all afternoon. Was it nice and sunny there? Yes. It was a very hot day. It was great there. Four. And on Saturday, it was basketball again. At school? With all my friends, yes. Was it a good game? Yes, it was. We all enjoyed it. Five. What did you do on Sunday? I read a book that Dad gave me on my birthday. What was it about? All about different sports. I want to be a sports teacher one day, Grandma. Great idea! Now hey, listen to Andy. part three again. What's that One. mean? What did you do? Do you want a can? Okay, here. Please listen Can here. I Please. listen again? Yeah, sure. Do on Thursday. It rained that day. I watched basketball on Thursday. At school? No, I didn't go to school that day. I watched it on TV with Dad. It was an exciting game. Two. I sometimes go swimming on Friday, but not last week. It was my friend's birthday. Oh. What did you do? We went to the cinema to see a film about someone who lived on an island. Hmm. Three. And what did you do on Wednesday? I went to the pool. I was there all oh. afternoon. Was it nice and sunny there? Yes. It was a very hot day. It was great there. Four. And on Saturday, it was basketball again. At school? With all my friends, yes. Was it a good game? Yes, it was. We all enjoyed it. Five. What did you do on Sunday? I read a book that Dad gave me on my birthday. What was it about? All about different sports. I want to be a sports teacher one day, Grandma. Great idea! That is the end of part three. Okay, so are you now ready to check your answer, Min? Okay, Diva. No? Do you want to listen again? No. No. So let's check now. Yeah. Okay, so let's check. What did Paul do last week? Okay, so on Thursday, they watch basketball on TV. On Friday, oh, they watch at the cinema. Okay. On Wednesday, this is Wednesday, they have swimming lesson. On Saturday, they play basketball. And on Sunday, they read a book. Okay, so your Yeah, that's Sunday. Okay, so for this one mean, you only got two out of five. Well, that's okay. So now mean... Uh, let's proceed with the next slide. Okay, this one. I want you to listen and tick the box. There is one example here. So let's listen carefully. You are allowed to listen twice. Part 4. Look at the pictures. Listen and look. There is one example. Where is Pat's dad going? Is that your father walking to the bus stop, Pat? Yes, it is, Sam. Where's he going? He's going to town for Mum. Is he going to the supermarket? No, I went there yesterday. 
and Mum's going to the library this afternoon. Oh, I know. He's going to the bank. Can you see the tick? Now you listen and tick the box. One. Which one is Pat's mother? Is your mother here, Pat? Yes, she's in the garden with my aunts. Has your mother got straight hair? No, her hair is curly. Oh, is she the one in the red dress? No, she's wearing trousers today. Two, what does Pat want to buy? Where are you going to go now, Pat? I'm going shopping. What do you want to buy? It's my birthday on Sunday, and I want something new to wear at my party. Do you want some new trousers? No, I'd like a skirt because my mum gave me a beautiful blue sweater. Okay, so do you want do you want to listen again or no? No. Okay, so let's check. Where is Pat's dad going? Is uh, the Pat's dad going to the bank? That's an example. Which one is Pat's mother? Okay. This one wearing a black, a black shirt and the red trousers. What does Pat want to buy? That's letter C. A yellow skirt. Okay, well, that's okay. <laughs> so now, let's proceed with numbers 3, 4, and 5. I want you to listen carefully so that you can choose the correct answer and put a tick inside the box. So let's listen now, Min. What was the weather like here yesterday? We went to the mountains yesterday and it rained. What was the weather like here, Pat? It was a beautiful day. Was it sunny? It was sunny. It wasn't cloudy at all. 4. Where's Peter? Where's your brother, Pat? Peter? I think he's playing outside. Is he in the garden? No, he isn't. He isn't on the balcony. I know. He went to the playground with his friends. 5. What will they take on the picnic? What do you want to eat on our picnic tomorrow, Pat? Something we can eat with our hands. What about sandwiches? No, we always take sandwiches. Can we take burgers? I don't like cold burgers. Shall we take sausages? OK. OK. So I am done. Okay. <laughs> Great, because you're done. For number three, what was the weather like here yesterday? That's sunny. Great. Where is Peter? Peter's in the playground. What will they take on the picnic? That's sausages. Wow. For this one, you got um. four out of five. Okay, that's a good score. So now, let's proceed with this one. I want you to listen, color, and draw. There is one example. So if there are some colors that you do not have, that's okay. You just keep that one and just tell me the color. Do you understand, Min? Okay, then let's begin. Part 5. Look at the picture. Listen and look. There is one example. Can you see the boy with the kite? Yes, I can see him. Well, colour the kite blue. The kite. That's right. Can you see the blue kite? This is an example. Now you listen and colour and draw. 1. There are two men running in the park. Can you see them? 
Yes, a thin man and a fat man. I want you to colour their T-shirts. What colour? Colour the fat man's T-shirt red and the thin man's yellow. OK. Two. Now I want you to draw something. Good. What shall I draw? Can you draw a duck? Yes, I can. <laughs> Good. Well, draw a duck swimming in the water. OK. Three. Now you can colour again. Good. Can you see the two cars? Yes. Shall I colour the small car or the big car? Colour the smaller one. Green. OK. I like that colour. Four. Now you can draw something again. Good. What about the weather? It's a cold day, so shall I draw a big cloud? Yes. Draw a big cloud above the two men and colour it black. Five. Now I want you to colour one more thing. Good. What shall I colour? The dog, please. Which one? Colour the biggest dog brown. There you are. That's very good. Now listen to part five again. One. There are two men running in the park. Can you see them? Yes, a thin man and a fat man. I want you to colour their T-shirts. What colour? Colour the fat man's T-shirt red. And the thin man's yellow. OK. Two. Now I want you to draw something. Good. What shall I draw? Can you draw a duck? Yes, I can. <laughs> Good. Well, draw a duck swimming in the water. OK. Three. Now you can colour again. Good. Can you see the two cars? Yes. Shall I colour the small car or the big car? Colour the smaller one. Green. OK. I like that colour. Four. Now you can draw something again. Good. What about the weather? It's a cold day, so shall I draw a big cloud? Yes. Draw a big cloud above the two men and colour it black. Yeah.
Stop, stop, stop. Yeah. Okay, so let's check your answer. Can you please read number one, mean? Color the fat man t-shirt red and the t man t-shirt yellow. Very good, because you color it red and yellow. How about number two? Draw a duck swimming in the water. I I don't know to draw the duck. Ah, it's okay. That's why you put like this. Mm. Is that why you put like this? That's okay. Okay, so where will you put the duck? Draw a circle and where will you put the duck? The duck uh, Very good. That's correct. Okay, so number three, can you please read? Color the small car green. Okay, color the small car green. Great job. How about number four? Draw a big draw a big black cloud. The bra above the two men. Okay, very good. That's the cloud. How about number five, the last number? Color the big that dog brown. Okay, so where is the biggest dog? I don't have brown. Yes, it's okay. Where is the biggest dog? Just circle the biggest dog. Okay, so this is the biggest dog. Okay, so for this one, mean you got four out of five okay so great job me um i'm going to ask you some question okay so since we still have time then i would like to inform you that there's a new rule in zoom that they limit my account for only 40 minutes so this will end automatically in 40 minutes so we only have two minutes left don't worry because next week I will I'm starting to upgrade my account in Zoom so that uh, I'll be able to render a complete 45 minutes class with all my students. Okay, so for the remaining five minutes, we will just extend next meeting. Is that okay with you, Min? Yeah. Okay. So Min, what did you do? today what did you do today what did um, you do i am eating and sleeping and play i am playing with the baby wow okay so what did you eat i eat chicken i eat I eat air and rice. Great. Wow, that's yummy. Okay. So what did you play today, Min? I play with the baby and toy. Oh, who is the baby? What's the name of the baby? It's Sam. Sam, is that your sister? Yeah. How it's old? Sister. Yeah, how it's old one. is Sam? One year one. old. How many sisters do you have, Min? I have one. One sister? What about brother? I have I have ten. You have ten brothers? Are you sure? <laughs> Are you sure you have ten brothers? <laughs> Okay, so maybe you only have one sister. Yes. Anyway, okay, what is your favorite subject? Five brothers, five. I don't. Five. 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 Five.